Thinking Rationally, the Laws of Thought Approach The Greek philosopher Aristotle was one of the first to attempt to codify right thinking, that is, irrefutable reasoning processes. His syllogisms provided patterns for argument structures that always yielded correct conclusions when given correct premises. For example, Socrates is a man, all men are mortal, therefore Socrates is mortal. These laws of thought were supposed to govern the operation of the mind. Their study initiated the field called logic. Logicians in the 19th century developed a precise notation for statements about all kinds of objects in the world and their relations among them. Contrast this with ordinary arithmetic notation, which provides only for statements about numbers. By 1965, programs existed that could, in principle, solve any solvable problem described in logical notation. Although, if no solution exists, the program might loop forever. The so-called logicist tradition with an artificial intelligence hopes to build on such programs to create intelligent systems. There are two main obstacles to this approach. First, it is not easy to take informal knowledge and state it in the formal terms required by logical notation, particularly when the knowledge is less than 100% certain. Second, there is a big difference between solving a problem in principle and solving it in practice. Even problems with just a few hundred facts can exhaust the computational resources of any computer unless it has some guidance as to which reasoning steps to try first. Although both of these obstacles apply to any attempt to build computational reasoning systems, they appeared first in the logicist tradition.